This is video recording. Uh, ooh, welcome back to SMG4 reaction videos. If you guys don't know what I did, we're reacting to more of them. Also, I'm a total moron and forgot to say in my first video I did, which was the uh, other one, that the original link will always be in the description of this video. Same for this one. Anyway, um, so as for what this video is going to be, I actually haven't figured that out yet because, again, I only closed it so I could make the outro. Oh, so nice. All right, so. Okay. All right, TikTok challenges. So what do we have? If it's true, we'll catch you. If it's false, <laughs> Mario doesn't help. Okay. Oh, yeah. Nope. And he's falling off the earth. That's a tall tower. The fire challenge. The participants dousing themselves in flammable substances before setting themselves alight. Okay. That is not. I won. How it works. I'm not eating any food for the next thirty days. Two minutes, Mario. Okay. I just want to bring this back up. So, here's the thing. Uh, if you don't eat anything for a total of 30 days, that is just you becoming self-mummified. Meaning you're dead. And there's actually a character in mythology that actually follows this rule. So let me bring it up and I'll talk about him for a little bit. You could cut ahead. I don't know if there's a time span, but yeah, just... Okay, here it is. So this character you see before you, Dai Saojo. Uh, this is the character that actually self-mummified himself. So if I remember correctly, uh... From his, like, info. Because I read it beforehand, because he was actually one of my favorite characters when I played the game. Uh, what happened was he self-mummified himself, himself by putting himself in a box. I think there was an airflow going around, and he died by doing this. By self-mummifying, by not eating or drinking. Uh... And if I remember the last detail, was actually related to this bell right here. So what would happen is, the way he would say, I'm still alive, is he would, he, he would ring the bell. And then, yeah. But as soon as the bell stops, they would cut the airflow and he's dead. So if you're some crazy person who wants to eat nothing for 30 days, let me be honest. Don't do it. The only thing that's going to evolve... Not eating for 30 whole days is death. Myself in that hole on purpose, and the only way I can get out is by challenging myself. I, feel like I can do this. Uh. Oh, yeah, ladies and gentlemen. Ow. That definitely would hurt. And now he's a skeleton. Oh, hi, Bob. Oh, yeah. Free skeleton. <laughs> right uh same song and dance as every other reaction video i have done except the dislike ones here we've just seen a cut ahead to a tiktok of what is called escaping serial killer challenge you're probably asking why there's a get a cut there i'm gonna keep repeating this every time i do reaction videos that involve this but I cut out all the advertisements because I don't want to buy the freaking, um... Because I'm not bothered to buy the, uh, the, the YouTube Premium. Because what YouTube Premium does is it would stop, prevent all the ads. But there's a catch. You have to buy it. Buy it afterwards. They, even though there is a free trial. But I only do these videos, like, once every three weeks. <laughs> so what's the point of me doing... That. I'm not a full-time reaction YouTuber. I'm just a temporary one who does it whenever the flippin' ecky feels like. Anyway, enough of the rant. Let's get back to it.
And how fast we could get out of these situations if Michael Myers was chasing us. Uh-oh. Uh. Oh, there's Michael Myers. We've been trying to contact you regarding your car's extended warranty for quite Oh, some yeah, time. he does look like a car repair. I've been trying to reach out and grab my extended wiener. <laughs> Let me guess, giant knife? <laughs> yep, giant knife! What? Oh, oh God, no, I missed Bowser. Oh. Next time I need a salad. <laughs> oops. <laughs> it just whoops. Oh god, what? Okay, hold on. Oops. I just want to go back. Alright, let's just quickly bring up the um the situation that we just saw. Because I want to talk about it. So here's like Bowser right there about to do Like here's Bowser deadlifting or Mario trying to deadlift Bowser. Um, it's kind of funny because if you guys remember the original, um, Super Mario 64, where you actually have to grab Bowser's tail and then just go, bye-bye, I nearly did the so long gay Bowser. <laughs> oh my gosh. So yeah, uh, he can do that, but Mario did lifting Bowser like that doesn't make sense to me, unless his only weakness is his tail. Next time I need a salad. But the other way around. Oops. Makes sense because Bowser just can throw Mario very far. In fact, I think, like, I'm not too sure if this is actually a true fact, but I think in Mario Party 8, uh, one of the boards in Mario Party 8, I think. Bowser would chuck you the other way in the Donkey Kong board. I haven't played the Donkey Kong board, so I have no idea. The only board I know of for Bowser from Mario Party 8 is he steals the stars, he steals coins in the uh, Cooper map, um, he steals coins in the uh, the booty boardwalk, he steals stars on the train, because I had a star stolen from him, and... Yeah, I think he just steals stars and coins, but I'm not sure about the fifth one. He either steals a star, or he'll just move the star thing? I don't know. Anyway, moving on to... What? Okay. I got a better idea. Uh... Well, that didn't work. Mission failed, because the bubble broke. DDR, okay. Okay. Oh, he's gonna... Dance Dance Revolution. I'm gonna go get a drink of water real quick. Oh no! Yeah, that one will automatically start, and I don't think it can pause planking. Ooh. Whoa! Hell yeah. What the? Oh, yeah. I'm not that good at planking, go. so. Mario's doing with an actual plank. Why would you love me? You're a fing loser, man. Get a life. Okay. Okay. Okay, so what is this? Did I jump scare you? No. Yeah, I bet I did. You coward. You make me sick. Your weakness is pathetic. So bad I don't have a beard. And this is me without a beard. Holy s. Okay. Wow. I gotta try this. Uh oh! Mario! Let me guess. Did it work? No, it shaved off your mustache. What? Oh god. You're an idiot. Like, wait, hold on, pause. Sp what? Okay, this does look like the weirdest challenge. Also, does this look like a Hungry Jacks? Because it looks like a Hungry Jacks to me. 
No, it's a Maccus. I just realized that is a Maccus right there because I see the Monopoly guy right in the corner. So this is at a Maccus because Maccus is the only fast food chain that I know of that has done the Monopoly game. And just so everybody knows, I haven't won anything from that yet because I don't eat Maccas often. But, so, let me get this clear. This is just... What is this challenge anyway? To spill the drink. It's just weird. There we go. You're an idiot. Uh, it's not like we have a say in this. Uh-oh. And... <laughs> okay. Oh, yeah! He's still going. What's this? I hereby sign the death warrant of an entire world and consign a million souls to oblivion. That's what the mask is! Oh, great heavens! I'm joking about somebody. Just do the double trouble. And he's still going. Uh, yeah, no, what lie? And he's a he's a cat. Uh oh, shotgun. Yeah, put that cat down. Okay. Okay. Really? Okay, let's just be clear about this. Like, what is this called? Steel School Items Challenge. What in God's free range beef do people do in their spare time? Because, listen, like, like, I gotta say this right now, but please do not do this in real life. If this was a game or a simulator, or like one of those VR games, you can do it. But in real life, don't steal other people's belongings. I've had a thing stolen. I have like I've had like things stolen from me in the past when I was in high school. Or at least one thing was stolen from me in high school, and it's still gonna linger in me to this in my brain to this day. And I lost, and I had a copy. Of a video game stolen. I had a copy of Pokemon Black stolen from me because here's what I did. I had another game that was being played and I mindlessly let the game there. So what happened was I did this. I walked out of the library and then as soon as I remembered it, it got stolen. So I've lost a copy of Pokemon Black. And before you guys say, wait, why do you have a copy of it right here? Because we had to buy a replacement. Because of my stupidity. And the copy ended up going into my younger brother's hands. But this wasn't the only copy I had. We've had a total of three games that are Pokemon Black that were in the same boat. Because I lost a copy, a copy was stolen, and now this is the third one. This ended up in Damien's hands, by the way. 
Me, so what's this Mario. message from Mario? Please? Um, I don't think you can do that. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yay, Thank you so much. The more you know- Yeah. If you steal things- Oh, he's still going. Uh-oh. <laughs> Kaboom. Back. That's why you should not do that. Oh, Jason Voorhees with a chainsaw! Uh oh. Interesting, but that's okay. Uh, that's only the second one, though. I've got one more of these to go, and who knows what more of these are going to go in the video. Uh, if you guys enjoyed, like, subscribe, bell icon, and leave a comment down below. And as always, I'll see you on a future video, whenever that is, because who knows? Because my recording sessions are very weird.